Hello, Bethel family. This coming Sunday, October 13th, we will welcome 14 local agencies to our church to participate in our third annual Local Fest event. Our entire service will be dedicated to local outreach, and you'll have an opportunity after service to consider your spiritual gifts and ways to use those gifts in serving our local community. If you want to learn more, visit Bethel.ch and click on the Local Fest link, which includes info about taking a spiritual gifts test. Local Fest is important to me because it's a great chance to honor some great organizations. I have forged deep friendships with many of these nonprofit executive directors. We tackled COVID together and have collaborated together many times to impact our local community. What a gift these agencies are to the Tri-Cities, but they need your help to fulfill their mission. 1 Peter 4.10 reminds us of the purpose of spiritual gifts, saying, God has given each of you a gift from his great variety of spiritual gifts. Use them well to serve one another. Spiritual gifts edify the body and they help the church be the church in our community and world. We are excited to see how God might be moving with your giftings as we explore local fest together. Speaking of spiritual gifts, you might have heard that the Lord has opened a new door for me to stretch some of my spiritual gifts by calling me to leave Bethel and serve as lead pastor at a small church in Indiana. This was unexpected, but it is a huge gift as it places me within 30 minutes of all my family. It's been many years since we have lived near each other, and it's a great joy to be near them again. But it's also very difficult to leave this church where you have become like family, as we have served together and loved each other through both joyful and challenging times these past 13 years. I have seen over and over that God is faithful and never leaves us nor forsakes us. He always provides and always leads us down paths of righteousness that are good and kind. We can walk into this time of uncertainty and unknown with confidence, knowing he is ordaining all our steps. It's painful to leave here, yet I know he has wonderful plans ahead for Bethel. This church is and should remain only dependent upon God, not on any staff member or pastor. God is not surprised by this move, and ministry will continue and thrive here. God has called me elsewhere, so I move in obedience, as does Bethel Church, knowing God is faithful and He will provide what is needed in my absence. My address may be changing, but my love and care for you is not. I look forward to continuing friendships made here, and please know that I will faithfully pray for Bethel and all of you. And you never know, I may show up to visit some Sunday in a crazy costume just when you least expect it. Thank you for allowing me into your lives and for loving me well, Bethel family. I am forever grateful. To God be the glory. Amen.